Do you want to hook your viewers and increase your watch time on your YouTube Shorts, Instagram Reels and TikToks? I'm going to show you how to animate your emoji, images and videos to do exactly that. Hi, I'm Seb and in this CapCut series, I'm showing you how to use the free CapCut editing app to grow your personal channel fast. So let's dive right into it. So I found this short from Alex Ramosi, which is ideal because it shows exactly the three points we're going to discuss today. The marketing, if you're IT, then you're thinking, how can I decrease page load times? How can I get conversion rates up? How can I organize the data? It shows exactly the emoji. It shows the images, and I'm going to show you how to remove the background from those images very easily in a few clicks and for free. Whether it's images of yourself, images of the influencer, or random images like in this case. And then finally, we're going to use stock videos to make what we say much clearer and more dynamic. And as a whole, it's going to look exactly like this. Okay, let's get started with the editing. So the first thing we're going to do is to add emoji. And there are three ways to do this. The first method is the easiest, which is simply to add emoji directly in your text, like you would do in a text message. That's the simplest way, but we're gonna skip it for now because it's just too basic. Then the two next options are to add the emoji as a text on itself or to add the emoji as an image. In both cases, to find the emojis, we will go to a website called Emojipedia. And here we can find any emoji we want. For example, we can find a checkbox, an airplane, a fire. Let's try it. Let's, for example, go for an airplane. We just click on the emoji. And then if you want to use the text version, you just copy here, click on copy. Either what you can do is you go to the Apple images, you scroll down and then here, you click save to photos and then it will be saved automatically to your computer. What I like about this version, about the images, is that it will stay on your computer afterwards. Now let's go back to CapCut. Uh, I have to click on allow paste and then here I can go to text, add text. And then here I can just paste my emoji and it arrives here. Now, now the next step is to add some animation on this. So let's do that. So therefore just click on your text go to animation. Let's for example, pick a slide left animation. And as you can see, I have a nice slide left animation inside inwards. And then I can also choose a slide right animation for the outer animation. And then that way I will just have the entire emoji passing through my screen. Have a look at our final results. The fastest way to grow your channel and online brand. And now we have a nice emoji going from left to right. Of course, um, I didn't pick the right emoji here. In this case, I should have chosen a rocket instead to illustrate the growth or a graph. I'll probably fix that in the final version. Now let's show you how we can do exactly the same, but with the image version. So on Emojipedia, I saved the emoji as an image. And now I can just add the image here as an overlay. So let's go overlay. And then in photos, I can add my airplane. And then with my airplane selected, I just click on animation. And then here I can give it any animation I want. For example, slide right as a in animation and then, and then slide right again as an out animation. And if I do that, so if I use the same animation for in and out, I'll get this effect. In 2023 is with you. Which is pretty good. Now the real advantage of using the image version and not the text version of the emoji is that you can collect all the emoji on your iPad or on your computer, which means that if you don't have an internet someday, you already have everything right there. You don't need to go to Emojipedia every time. Okay, now the next thing we're going to do is to add this type of outlined image to our video. Therefore, I just go to overlay and I add one of my own photos. And then with this photo selected, I just go to cut out. Here I click on remove background and as you can see, the background has been removed. And then what I like to add is I like to add solid color around it, which gives it a nice white line around. I validate that and here, here I am, I have my nice picture of myself, to which I can of course give an animation. For example, I use a swing animation, there we go. And I have a great swing animation. Now, as you see, my text is already integrated inside the image because it's the result from our previous tutorial where I explained how to add auto captions and how to stylize your texts, but else I would easily have been able to move the text to make the image fit. Okay, and now the final trick that they use, which is animating a stock video inside the shorts. Therefore, just use the app called Pexels. It's a free library of stock photos and stock videos, and it has everything you need for free. Just search any type of video you need. For example, let's say an airplane again, just to make it easier. 
let's go to videos and then here let's just select the first video i download the video and then now i can just integrate this video in my CapCut project in a few clips just go to overlay again and as you can see in my recent videos the airplane video from pexels appeared and i can integrate it for just a few seconds and again i'm quite limited because i already integrated the text inside my images but what i would do now is i would move the text a little bit upwards to make this video fit the screen and integrate my shorts properly and here again you can give an animation let's go again with slide left slide left here okay and as the out animation we go with slide left as well and we'll have the same effect of the video passing through our screen matter of minutes if you can't produce and there we go we now use all the same effects that alex hormos used in his example if you're interested in how to automatically add captions to your videos and how to stylize your text like the pros you can have a look at this previous video i made about that see you soon